Chris Adams was, um, he was a good guy. He could be a good friend as long as alcohol wasn't involved. If alcohol was involved, Chris could get very violent and uh, he could get very mean. I saw him uh, in, in, in Israel. We had a case where I literally had to sneak him out of the country after he super kicked uh, one of the bartenders and uh, literally put his eye out. Can you tell uh, us the whole, sorry, the whole story behind that? Well, Chris was wrestling for uh, us in uh, Israel and uh, we had two different hotels. We had all the baby faces, the good guys at one hotel, and we had all the hills at another hotel. And I get a phone call that you gotta come over here and get Chris Adams. Uh, he got drunk and he got into an argument with the bartender and Chris had this super kick. It was real. Well, Chris had reared back and kicked this guy at the bar and when he did, just the way he hit him, the guy's eye came out and, uh, and ruptured. The promoter there called me and said, you gotta take him to a different hotel. And so they were all worried about retaliation and we were worried about charges, criminal charges. And so uh, the promoter had all of our passports and he come and told me, you gotta get Chris out of the country. And so um, literally at about 3 a.m., I went downstairs, went into where the passports were, got Chris's passport. We walked down the street, we took a cab, went to the airport, and we didn't know if he was gonna get through or not. We knew they were probably gonna block his passport. And I watched him go through security and saw him walking out to get on the plane. So I knew he was through. And by the time I got back, literally by the time I got in my hotel room, it wasn't 30 minutes, there was a knock on my door. And when I opened the uh, door, it was a policeman and an investigator wanting to know had I seen uh, Chris Adams, did I know where he was at? And I said, no. And he said, I just woke up and uh, what's up? And it, was a, it took him about a half a day. They knew he would got on the plane back to the States. Chris was a phenomenal uh, instructor of wrestling. Not everyone can teach wrestling. You know, you, there's, there's some people that can be a great athlete or a great whatever at a certain sport, but you can't teach it. You know, uh, you can't be a coach. Uh, Chris was a great person to teach. Matter of fact, uh, hey, Chris taught uh, uh, Steve Austin. You know, that was one of his students. And uh, we all know where he went on to be.